this is the LG Q7 Plus from Metro by T-Mobile and today I'm going to be showing you the setup process of the device as you can see here we are on the welcome screen and the language that I'm going to be using it is English so now we're going to be tapping on this arrow connect to Wi-Fi to get apps or copy data connect to a network so as you can see here this device supports uh, 5 gigahertz so I'm going to be getting connected to my 5 gigahertz and now let's uh, put the password and after you're done tap where it says connect Wi-Fi connected you are now connected to Netgear's 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi network when you see this symbol at the top of your screen you are able to use your device for calling and messaging even if you have no cellular coverage they took about this symbol the phone with the Wi-Fi icon as you can see there so if you want to learn more about it, you want to tap where it says learn more, but I'm going to be skipping this, so tap where it says skip. Copy apps and data, transfer apps, photos, music and more, choose what to copy later. So here I'm going to set the phone as new, so tap where it says set up as new, get a fresh start. Here you can sign into your Google account. So you can go ahead and sign into your Google account. I'm just gonna tap on skip. Skip. Okay, so after you're done signing into your Google account, then you're gonna uh, put your name here. It says name, adding your name allows your phone to personalize some apps. So tap on next. Add your fingerprint, use your fingerprint to unlock the screen or see lock content in galleries and quick memo plus. Before you add your fingerprint, you will need to set up or confirm a second way to unlock your phone, such as pattern, pin, or password. Note, fingerprint unlock only saves the information needed to recognize your fingerprint. Images of your, images of your fingerprint are not saved. Your fingerprint may be less secure than a strong pattern or pin. So I'm going to be skipping this for now because I'm going to be making a separate video uh, showing you how to set up your fingerprint. Uh, so tap where it says not thanks. Next. Skip fingerprint setup. Device protection features will not be activated. You won't be able to prevent others from using this phone if it is lost or stalling or wipe. Skip anyway. Protect your phone. Pattern pin passer or not now so I'm gonna tap where it says not now skip screen lock device protection features will not be activated you won't be able to prevent others from using this phone if it is lost stolen or wiped skip anyway Google services so tap on more and accept legal documents so just tap agree agree and done Okay guys, as you can see here, we are on the uh, home screen. So now let's go into settings to see um, what sort of version are we running. Tap on general, scroll all the way down, and tap where it says about phone. And then tap where it says software info. So as you can see here, we are running Android version 8.1.0. And we are running the Android security patch level from November 1st, 2018. And the software version ends on 10K. So that's going to be all for this video. We have successfully done the setup process of the LG Q7 Plus from Metro by T-Mobile. So thank you very much for watching my video. If you like my video, please click the like button. You can subscribe to my channel so you can get more content. If you have any questions, please leave it down below. Thank you for watching my video. Bye-bye.